Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Insurgents. In the last episode, we basically encountered Reggie Steel and the his Delta counterpart in the cave. Professor Maple literally just threw a Master Ball at it while it ran past Jason Reggie Steel. But yeah, <laughs> and then we also found a Delta Staple Light in the same cavern as where the Delta Reggie Steels passed through. And then we went back to the Hello Lake where we saw the Reggie Ice's battle. And Professor Maple was there, already caught the Delta Reggie, about Professor Pine with it, beat her, and then Professor Pine gave us a Master Ball to uh, basically catch Reggie Gigas, I believe, up here, to prevent Professor Maple from having all of the Reggies. So let's get on with that. So do I go all the way up, or is there something over here? Uh, we don't need another repel. Yeah, just boxes. Okay, so I guess we're going straight up here. I guess we go this way. I don't think it matters. Is this the cavern? Is this the cave? Or is there an item chilling around somewhere? You no. Okay, so let's just go straight in. Is the wild encounters in here? I want to say no, but I mean I'm, I might just be lucky for once in my life to not run into anything. Okay, yep, there's, there's Loud and Gallants. Okay. Better gotta go back into my back then. Use my repel. Keeping that time permeable. Okay, just randomly chilling. The for item. Iron. I don't even know if anyone on my team can actually take that, but I mean... I've got a few Deltas which I haven't used yet. And I guess those stones represent the three Reggies? So are we close then? Perhaps so long ago it may have been some sort of puzzle, but it seems to have since faded away. No, wait. Did I? No, it's a rock. I thought I saw something across the water. Hello. Is it coming out the hole? I like how it just sensed my presence and was like, Yo, I wake up now. Sorry, but did you... <laughs> Richie Gigas's cry. It just sounds like some kind of DJ track or something. <laughs> Not the best one, but eh. Quick save it quickly. And let's go. I mean, I could just chuck the Master Ball at it. But... I kind of want to save that for something else. It's reacting to my crystal pieces. Oh, God, no. No, 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 no. Oh, what the... You're so big that you don't even fit on the screen. What is this? Go for an ice punch then. We can weaken this one for once because it's level 100. Okay, we don't do it a lot. Maybe get the paralysis or something. Don't you dare flinch. Oh my god. The flinches. Don't know. Thank you. Critical hit. No paralysis. Yeah, we don't outspeed it. Okay, it's gone for a wild guard. Don't get a critical hit. Good. We don't want to kill it. Good. Okay, let's throw up the snowball. I don't. Oh, we have a heavy ball. That might work pretty well, actually. I can't get how big it is on the screen. It, it doesn't even fit in the screen. One heavy ball. Well, I mean, it, it looks like it's got a mountain on its back, like a volcano, so I mean... Okay, it was worth a try. Okay. Uh, going to muck. Got a lot of HP and tank some hits, I guess. Um... 
really don't want to have to keep spamming Pokeballs, but hey, whatever it takes. I don't want to use my Master Ball. This might take a very long time. Give it a, another Snowball, and then maybe another Ultra Ball, and then if that doesn't work, then I might cut until when I catch it, because it might take a pretty long time. So, I don't want you guys to be bored out of your minds. Okay, let's throw the Ultra Ball. Come on, catch it. Catch it. Okay, not, not even close. Alright. I'll probably cut into when I catch it then. So I'll see you guys then. Okay, I captured it the first try on this reset. Because <laughs> I teach Glade from the wave to help me. It looked pretty nice then. Caught it with the heavy ball. Nice. Okay. Don't need to give it a nickname. Would you like to access your PC to Asbury Gigas to your party? Ah, uh, nah. It's not a Delta. So, um. Uh, we don't need it. I see I'm too late. I was hoping to complete the entire collection, but I guess it's worthless. Reggie Gas isn't a double species after all. It was a valiant attempt, Adam, I'll give you that. But double species are the way of the future. Even if you do get Reggie Gas on your side, you can't stop me. Nobody can stop me. I've come too far. Bohaha. I'm going to take you down. Even you, the Agor, don't stand a chance against me. Not anymore. Not even with Reggie Gas. Let me show you now, Adam. Let me show you my incredible power. Don't even get me a chance to heal my Gallade. He doesn't know bulk up anymore, so I mean, it, it's, it's kind of worthless. Oh, so you got, you got Della Charizard too, I see. Um, if we outspeed it, get an Ice Punch. But start with a Mega, right? Well, that's fine. Hopefully we outspeed it. No, we don't. And we're not going to let it hit them. I'm glad I got the reset done, because I only had um, Cleaver left on the first try. So, I mean, if I forgot to revive, then I, I wasn't going to win at all. Okay, so we do front. We're going to Mega Revolve, we'll go for a Shadow Ball. I'm, I'm open to knock it out with one hit. Would of Dragon Ball spin better? Nah. I, I think Shadow Ball does more good damage. Yeah. And the darkness will help, so. And we got it. Nice. Okay. Blastoise. Uh, if that's gonna be Delta as well, then we'll switch into Cleaver. Go for a Dream Punch. I like how his name is Mad Professor Maple. Yeah. Okay, we'll, we'll get some bull cups off. Use the revive. Really? I, I hate it when you do this. You know what I mean? You're giving me a free bull cup? I don't mind. And you miss your focus points. What annoys me is that it outspeeds me. With that big shell on its back. Okay, that's enough ball cups, I think. We'll go for a drain punch if we live. Come on, you can live. Who can live? Blizz. Thank you. And let's get all that HP back now. Can I get a one hit? Oh, yeah. yeah. I kind of was hoping for a bit more HP recovery there, but I'll take it. Ready Rock, so I'm guessing this is going to be the ground type one. Pretty cool.
cool actually. Uh, be weak to ice. Won't it? Yeah. Goodbye, Mr. Sandman. So what I'm getting here is all the Reggies are pretty much just melted versions of the pre-existing selves. Uh, you'll be psychic and fairy. We don't really have a move to deal with that. So let's go into our ultimate fairy type killer. Luxury. Okay, let's get the poison jab off. I think that's the first time we've seen Delta Venusaur in this game. What impresses me that there's more than one of the original Delta starters. Uh, go into Muk. Pretty sure it's a fire type. Well, I mean, it's it's mild and lava, but I mean, who knows for sure? Super effective, so I mean, I guess. Okay, we didn't get the one hit. Regular station's not gonna do a lot, is it? Nah. Yeah, we can live a Giga Impact. And you give me a free turn to basically finish you off. Which, I mean, I can't complain. So we only got. Reggie Ice now, don't we? Oh wait, we got two left. Reggie Ice. Wait, we're taking out... Oh wait, he revived the Charizard, didn't he? And I forgot to switch out for this. Uh, crap. I'm just go for an Earthquake. If it's Watertight, Regurgitation should do a lot of it on damage as well. Close, but not enough. And I was extremely expecting to lose to this, this battle here, but okay. That full restore won't save you. I mean, it will for this turn, but not for next turn. And if you keep full restore, Mr. Madman, I want to be happy. Come on, please, stop, <laughs> stop. This is nothing to do with the power of doubters anymore. This is the power of all restores. And uh, let me say, they do have some power. I mean, right now, I mean, he's using full restores, but I'm slowly healing with leftovers, so I mean. It's a whole more of a win for me. We revive the Charizard. So let's go back into our Charizard. What can you do now? You can't Mega Revolve, sir. <laughs> and that should be it. What? No, impossible. But, but how? That's impossible. My doubters are superior. Unbeatable. No, my doubters are superior. Unbeatable. You must have cheated. It sabotaged me. Cheating is an academic offense warranting explosion? Never mind. I'll buy my time for now. I'll... It's over, Maple. You lost. Just give it up. You can't arrest me. I'm the leading researcher at the Halloween University. I've won awards, I've captured legendaries, I have tenure. <laughs> Let's just make it easy on both of us, Buster. Let's go. Well, that was easy, he didn't even resist. Jeez. Listen, Adam, I owe you one. Maybe two. I can't really repay you for all you've done for the Hololum. Helping us with our resource, exploring the region, and stopping Prof Professor Maple. Listen, I'm sure you know about my Pokeball inventions. It's not much, but hopefully this can help you out. Ancient balls. 
The Ancient Ball is as strong as an Ultra Ball, but if you use it on a legendary Pokemon, it has many times the catch rate. And again, thank you. The idea of such a young ago weirded me out at first, but you know, if everyone is worthy of that position, it's you. Hopefully you don't turn out to be a traitor too, eh? I won't be a traitor if you keep giving me more of those Delta Balls. Oh, sorry, Ancient Pokeballs. Wait, can I just use an escape route? Save a bit of time, you know? I don't want to run all the way back out. There we go. So, is that the end of our Hololum region journey? I mean, this was the last possible point we could come up to, so I guess so. Oh, but does that mean if I want to go all the way back and get back to the Torrent region, I have to run all the way back down the mountain, through past the lake, back through the settlements? <sighs> you make me cry. Okay, so... Yeah, we can buy the Ancient Balls now. They cost a tiny bit more than the... Wait, she gave me 20. Ho, 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 ho. Um, they do cost a lot. I'll get another 20 of them. I'm pretty much bankrupted. Well, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. Wait, I didn't heal up, did I? Just quickly heal. Oh wait, I'm pretty sure I'm healed because I'm pretty sure Gallade f like got beaten. But anyway guys, I'm going to end the episode here. In the next episode, I'll probably start off back in Suntouch City for the next part of the post-game. Because uh, I believe we're done in the Hulu region now, unfortunately. There probably is, there's, well, there's definitely a few Deltas we've probably missed around the region, which we may come back to later in the game. But yeah, I'll probably continue on with the post-game. Like, we did get that phone call from Orion back before we started coming here back when we beat the timeless so we'll go check on him next episode and see what he was wanting but yeah anyway i'm gonna end the episode here and i'll see you guys for the next episode goodbye